Hello guys, welcome to C Learning with new video. In this video, we will learn about IPv6. So we connect two PCs and uh, we communicate two PCs by giving IPv6 address. Uh, mostly we use IPv4. Address 192.168.10.10.10.12 or, 10 .10 .10 .10 uh, or uh, these are the slash 24 is a subnet mask. Uh, in this video, we will learn about how to connect two PCs via IPv6. So in IPv6, uh, this is the IPv6 address. You can also show this address in this form uh, 2001 and you can eliminate these le leading 0, 3 leading 0 and write this as 1 and also all these 4 0 in only in 1 uh, 0 and these 4 0 in 1 0 in all 4 0 1 0 eliminate uh, you can eliminate these leading zeros uh, in last uh, 0 0 0 a you can uh, remove these uh, three zeros because these three, three zeros uh, do not have any impact on a so you can just write a a so you can uh, write this in this form and also you can short this uh, form to this form 2001 and if you have these leading zeros uh, 0 comma colon 0 colon 0 colon 0 you can just replace this five zero with double colon but you can do it only once once you can do it uh, double colon so you can see here two zero zero one one and double colon a it means that you eliminate five zero five zeros if you open this you uh, understand automatically that uh, you have eliminate five zero you have to put five zero so you will uh, uh, Take the you will uh, get the IP v6 address of 8 octet. You can see here 1 octet, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 8 octet, 1, 2, 3, and 5, 0 in this double colon. So this how so you can uh, write in any way. Uh, we will test that uh, is IPv6 address work or not. So first of all, we pick this and slash 64 is a subnet mask is a subnet mask like uh, we use the slash 24 in uh, IPv, IPv4 class C so this is the subnet mask slash 24 okay you can write slash 20 uh, sorry slash 64 because uh, it's the it is uh, uh, 128 bit long address so half of which we use as network address and half we use the customer id like in ipv so ipv4 we use uh, customer id and host id network id and host id it means that this is first 64 bit are these are first 64 bit are uh, network id and uh, these are the host ids so 64 means these 64 bits so 64 so for now we copy this we copy this copy and uh, go in pc and here here we give the ipv4 but here we give ip double colon here you can see double colon it means that all zeros double colon mean all zeros so if you write here double colon one it means that all zeros in end one zero 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 triple zero one it means that this so but we use our own ip to this IP address A, A in this side and B on the, that side. Okay, apply. And here we use prefix length. What is prefix length? 64. And we don't do not need a gateway because uh, we are using point to point. So there is no router, so we do not need any gateway. Here as well, just paste here and write here B. B and 64. 64 okay now we go in command prompt and ping ping paste this a let's see yes it's reachable and now we will ping p b all and in end b so you can see here it's reachable point to point it also pc2 is also reachable from pc a from here pc1 and pc2 now we will replace this IP address with this short IP address. Let's see it work or not. So let's see. 
sorry first of all we have to assign the ip address this this is the shorter form let's see it's work or not slash 64 it means that first four digit are network address okay and here as well we eliminate first and write b here and 64 okay let's see it's work or not let's go back and ping a yes it's reachable you can see here this short form also work and if you write b here so you can see here is short form let's see the more short form this is the another short form you can eliminate these zero and write double colon let's see this form as work or not copy now we go here and replace this with this apply and here as well and write b because we have to defer the ip address from okay let's ping again ping this form you can see here ipv6 address is pinging and if we ping b so you can see here the another one is also pinging if you write here c it will not ping because uh, there is no any c pc ip pc with ipv6 address and with c so you can see here no pc c is present only b if we replace this pc with ip address c it will ping definitely ping but it will not ping b it will ping c yes it will not ping b because there is no ip address with b so this is the ip address now in our next video we will learn about more about uh, ip v6 uh, we put router here and uh, communicate these two pcs and then we uh, learn about ospf v3 dhcp v3 and many more about v dhcp uh, ipv6 forms so thank you very much